Hi guys, welcome back to Unicorn Fan and today I'm still with my friend Lily and we're going to be doing some arts and crafts. We're going to be um, making, so first we're going to be making a um, your own colourful stick. What we're going to do And we're going to make an awesome craft out of these as well later. So, um, so first you'll need a lollipop stick. You'll get your own lollipop stick. You can get whatever colour you want from a whole pack. And you can just start opening. You'll need a glitter glue pack. Oh, a big pie at the back there. You'll need a glitter glue pack. I'm going to use a red one so I have a red one. So you'll need a glitter glue pack with loads, loads in it. And you'll need a pop. So you're making our own flower, like so you'll need glitter glue, you'll need these kind of um, kind of shaped kind of leaves. And I'm gonna use pom-poms because there isn't any of these that are red and yes. my flower's gonna be all red, so I'll have to use these pom-poms exactly. Yes. Sorry. Okay, so we'll need some scissors for this as well for our um and it's going to be really good this craft is really good for some um some children yeah so you'll need some card some card yeah. i'm going to like this card cardboard and you'll need um some orange
I need to show everyone. I need. To I need to, can I do it on a, this piece of paper? Okay. When you've stopped. Okay, guys, okay, I'm back. When you've stuck your middle part on, you're going to just get um another piece of whatever you like, whatever colour you want. So I chose green. I'm going to use green to cut to cut this um to cut um out the um petals. Let's just put that over there. And now that I've cut it out, I'm going to um, shave down, shave, <laughs> shave it down. And and um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to make the um, orange go away, so it looks like I just hand made it. My goal. Okay, and when you cut your petal, you can ask permission for this craft if you, if you really want to. And just on the outside of your um, wait, what side of your you flower? On? on the petal. Really, I think it's still on this part. Because okay. I, because I can, I was literally freaking out. At the back of your um, middle part of your flower, you're going to just put some PVA glue. Or you can put it on on your um, petal. Um, you'll just grab your lolly stick from and out of your um, PVA glue. Yeah. And you're going to put oh. it. Oh, sorry. And you're going to put it onto your petal. I know. Do, while you're doing that, do you want me to look for your stuff? Please. Is this a handmade squishy? No, it's um, a sponge made cake made out of craft. Or you can do it at the front, put some glue on the front of your petal. So what step are you on? Petals. Okay, so I'm going to do the pom-poms as petals. Now I'm going to do it with little pom-poms. So let's take some of the pom-poms out so I can get to the little pom-poms. So I can get one more little. Okay, if I use all the reds, because I need four reds, and there's three big ones and one small one. There's still um like some little ones, yeah. some little red ones in there. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Isla. Welcome. You're the mean. best friend ever. <laughs> and just put your um PVA glue on the front of your um petal. Put that in there. And um, put your PVA glue on the front of your petal and just stick it on. I'm going to put that there. Stick a pom pom. Oops! Nothing <laughs> happened. I totally just dropped my flower. Can we not put any mu music on this? Because it just, you know, if you didn't see our makeup tutorial one, sorry if you can hear us, it's because Isla decided to put music on it. <laughs> so you can see, so you can hear us. So that was bad. I, I thought it would be a bad idea to do that. And, um, yeah, so. Why won't this pom pom stay on? You know what? I'm just going to use the glitter. Glue. Just stick your um petal onto your um middle part of your flower, and keep on making <laughs> your petals. I accidentally maybe put too much on it. Okay, I think that will stay. Just keep on cutting out some more petals for your um your flower. And just keep sticking them on from the front of the petal onto your flower. Yeah. And I, and trust me guys, I am not an expert as at all. 
arts and crafts. She said she was a perfectionist. Well, not a perfectionist. So, right, so this is what I'm doing. Since and I, just put it on your, oh, um, since I have, your petal. Since I'm getting really stressed out, I'm going to squish this for a few minutes. It's very stress relieving. Yeah. We, um, we also, broke, yeah, we broke Candice's stress ball on her first day she got it. On her birthday, yes. And it went everywhere on the carpet. It like just splat everywhere. Were you doing a video? No. Oh. We were opening yellows as presents for my friends. Okay, and just keep on, and just continuously um keep doing your petals. Do you have anything where I can um spread this out? And you know what? I'm just gonna use a sander to stop because I am too. I'm not bothered. Um, I can't be bothered to get another one. So let's just spread that. Nothing happened. Does your sister have a boyfriend? Two exes. Cool. One boyfriend named Jake, but she secretly hides because Jake doesn't really love her. And then her ex ex boyfriend, John, which is really nasty to her now. He was really not, I don't, I, I can see why she broke up with him. If he was being nasty, why would she, um, huh? want him in the first place? How did Leighton love you first? I don't know. You look really pretty with your makeup on. Yeah, because you did it. Why weren't these pom-poms stay on? You know what, I give up, I'm doing the same as you. Okay, so just keep on drawing your petals from your Yay. card. Just kidding. Where did you get these petals? Oh, probably. I'm just going to use... The and ones. when you finish, um, just keep, keep continuously doing your petals. I'm going to put some real um, foam petals on here because I can't be bothered to do um, homemade petals right now. I'm just really, really, really not into this properly. And here's what your flower will look like in the end. You can't do the bottom because it might ruin it. So just um, stick it back on to your flower. How does that look so far? It's really good. No, it looks really bad. Um, then no. just get... Um, get um, back here. Come here. Okay, get it. That is. Then get to your foam shapes and you will need um, four. I got four. Just the coin because I was going to do it for the um, Okay, just get all your foam shapes out and look, and you'll need um, a few. You'll need two um, shaped sleeves. Or you I, can have one. I put four so then it looks like I did something because I'm getting kind of um, bored of just trying to do one step, which is really hard. <laughs> you know which step I was on? Just trying to stick it all down. Okay, now just... um. Now just um, stick on your um, your leaf onto your um, onto your stem. I can't wait to do the 
it down. Can you read? Mm -hmm. And then you have your little flower. Okay. I just need one more. Little flower. Just gonna wait for Lily, cause Lily is going to show yours right now. It looks really bad. It looks like a upside down butterfly. <laughs> it looks like a bit of up, an upside down butterfly. Okay, so, so that's a wrap, I guess. So next, what we're going to do is be made, making a butterfly. Um. I've already so, made a butterfly. It's a flower and a butterfly. We're going to try and make um, a monster out of these. So, um, let's get started, I guess. So, we're going to be doing something with this in like the Yeah, next we're going video. to do the butterfly next. So, first, what you'll need is you'll need these, um, Scrunchy things. These, we'll need this scrunchy um slime ball. Yeah. If you've got some at home, you then you can use this. And just you'll need to shape your um. It's just you can slime you can foam. get a really tough slime that has loads of like yeah. beads in it. Yeah. So as you can see, oops, there's loads of beads in this, which makes this slime very 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 hard. Okay, you'll need to mold your um your foam slime into a tr um a specialized three D triangle. So make the bottom flat. Wait, let's just put this and um and just shape a little um bit at the top. Yeah, and just shape like a triangle. Yeah, I, just I am really good at triangles. That because when you are trying to get a steady base and a flat one all you need to do is you just need to mold it and then suddenly when you look at the bottom it's um flat look and you can mold this on a table yeah like we are yep mold this on a table so it comes out really nice and good let's put that in there so and then you'll need um some googly two big eyeballs. I'm gonna use medium googly ones. eyes. Two big googly eyes, and you're just gonna stick them into your slime. I am foam base. I am trying to make it perfect. Perfect, I mean, though. Is yours the bigger one? No, like, no, it's me. no like, like whose are these? Are these just yours? Did you mm. make these? No. I bought them. I bought these. I've always wanted one of these. It's okay. Um, so then, guys, when you have, like, a 3D triangle, kind of like this one. Yeah, when you put your, um, googly eyes in your slime foam bead it kind of thing. It kind of matches my nails. Yeah, oh. when you put your eyes in your foam bead um slime then you're just going to make a hole with your finger inside the slime base yeah. foam slime whatever it's called um and that is all today i hope you enjoyed this video make sure you give this video a big thumbs, thumbs up that. just hit that big thumbs up button and smash it in the face <laughs> and, and just smash it in the face and then um just press a big subscribe button and does just, this look does this look pretty close and, <laughs> and then just hit that big notification bell make sure it's dinging and and make sure you never
Okay, bye guys! Bye!